the title of the project is called Farewell in Labrador. Um, uh, I knew the backbone of the story, um, which is uh, going to be about the, the Inuit culture kind of on the brink of extinction. Uh, I knew there was a lot of unemployment because of the death of the fishing industry. And also there was an, um, quite a big American air base that was decommissioned a few years prior to me getting there. So I guess the theme was always going to be saying goodbye to people, to the culture, to friends. So that was kind of my backbone in the story. And when I got there, and um, I figured that kind of the world farewell fits in very well because it, it, it was a very depressing place and very isolated. I mean, I grew up in a city and I live in London. Um, so kind of being, when I, the plane landed, it was a village of 20 people. And it, I was completely freaked out. And I think I got really lonely. And the, the community is so isolated. Um, there's only a, a weekly boat that kind of takes me to, between these places. So once I'm somewhere, I've got to be there for the week. And I, I was doing my thing, I was sitting at my camera, trying to get people to talk to me. And a lot of time I was literally knocking on doors. And with this particular picture, uh, I actually met the family living inside. And, I was chatting to them, I was looking for a nice picture um, and I kind of mentioned what they look forward to the most and they said they look forward to the winter the most because actually winter when the snow comes down they're more mobile with the skidoos um, and then so also Christmas I look forward to and then I kind of remember as I was walking in the, the Christmas tree it's still outside and I, I think that, that was the point I thought actually that makes a nice, much nicer picture. It's obviously a, very, a tree that's died um, they left the Christmas light on since the Christmas before and, and this picture was taken in August, so it's, it's you know it's eight months, and it's, you know, it's ready for the next Christmas. Um, and kind of because it was, I just I mean everything ended up perfect because the war was all worn out, the tree is dead, and yet there's a little, little bit of hope that it's what they enjoy, it's what they love, uh, the Christmas light, this kind of symbol of happiness, um, and that's why I took the picture. It's a kind of nice juxtaposition.